Kira here, and I've got a haul video for you guys. Um, so my mother-in-law just came to visit really recently, and she's always trying to like pamper me. She knows I'm I stay home with kids all day, and my whole life just revolves around my kids. And I know she really appreciates that I take good care of her grandkids, so she always wants to pamper me. But she always wants to like. So I was like, well, do you want to go get your nails done? And I mean, come on now. That's not really my thing. <laughs> so um, she knows I like craft supplies. So she gave me some cash to spend on craft supplies. So I've been really wanting these stamps that I had seen from Ellie's studio. So I decided to just buy them because I had been drooling over them for too long and I just really needed to buy them so so that's what I did so I um, purchased more than just a couple stamps at Ellie's studio um, but I wanted to show everything I bought with you guys so I haven't really I peeked in here but I haven't really taken a good look so um, I'll just go ahead and jump right in so it looks like I got a cute little card here little thank you which is nice um, if you guys aren't following um, Ellie's studio on Instagram you definitely should because um, they always have the cutest stuff so um, definitely follow them on Instagram um, so I'll start with this these are little acrylic stars and I'm obsessed with them oh my gosh how cute are these you guys so there's different sizes, um, and then some of them are like filled in, and some of them, most of them are like this. I really like these ones. Super cute. So those, slide those aside. This is one of the stamps that I was obsessing over. Let me kind of zoom in here. You guys can see better. Um, so me and my husband are big readers. Um, we read a lot. Um, him probably more than me, um, but we definitely watch our fair share of TV, but we read a lot. And uh, one of our favorite things to do is to go to the bookstore. So I really liked this stamp set. And I showed my husband it because I thought that it would be really fun for us to make um, a scrapbook album of all the books that we've read. Um, and then we could, you know, write kind of our review of the book. Um, and you can do like, I really like like these little stars that you can do here, Put the title of the book and then the stars and you can fill them in with that star. And these little books are cute. Little glasses are adorable. The whole stamp set's adorable. So really excited about this one. Um, this one was out of stock for a while and they restocked it recently. And I just wanted to make sure that I got it when they restocked it because it's so cute. I really, really, really like the lines. That's mostly why I got it because I want to make my own journaling cards. And I think that the lines are amazing because they're like, there's like one straight one. But there's like kind of like a little wonky line. This one looks like a brush stroke and then little dots and the arrow. But I think they're all so cute. Um, these, if you're wondering what these are, Mary wondered what those were and actually asked on Instagram and, um, they're basically like, you can put them on like the side of a word to kind of emphasize the word is what Ellie said. Um, but yeah, it's like I heart and you can write what you heart. I said, you said, I am currently today was. I just think it's really cute and it's gonna be good for making my own journaling cards. I got some puffy star stickers. Um, I'm kind of obsessed with stars on things. I, I think hearts are really cute too, but I tend to go more towards stars. And I don't know if it's just because I have boys and I scrapbook a lot of boy stuff, but I just really love a good star. and <laughs> I really love puffy stickers. So I'm, I think these are super cute and I'm super excited to use these because I love the colors. And yeah, so those, I got those. I should have bought more of those actually. I got a little die. This is just a little label die. Um, and I just thought this would be cute to make my own labels. Um, I do have like a ticket punch that's similar to this, but it's not the same size. Um, so yeah, I just thought that that would be cute to make my own labels. Um, I got 
a bunch of their little cut apart sheets um, and these I just thought would be good for my project life um, so these ones are just blank but these ones have like little sayings and some of them photo notes this right here love you you are my number one always my favorite um, so yeah I thought those would be cute these were like super cheap like 35 cents or something so I just threw them in my basket because I was I was pampering myself right so yeah I really liked those for project life and I've got some more acrylic stars I believe these ones were on sale um, for like a dollar 35 or something because it's like their winter mix so they're um, they have different colors and everything now um, that are like the newer ones. This is kind of like their old stock. Um, but I just thought the colors were really pretty. Well, except for the purple. I don't like purple. If you guys don't know that about me. <laughs> purple is not my favorite. But maybe Mary would want those. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see if she wants those. But I really liked um, the green and the teal. Basically every other color except for the purple I liked. So I got two packs of those. This stamp I'm so excited about. So this is um, like a TV stamp. It's the TV stamp set. Um, and it's, you know, got currently watching, spoiler alert, let's stay and watch TV, fave show. It's got the star rating, which I really liked on the book one. This cute little TV stamp. And I've documented, I think in one week, I documented what show we were watching. Because me and my husband, we, we don't have like cable we have a Roku um, which is like a streaming device and so we watch a lot of Netflix and Amazon shows um, and then and we like binge watch them so right now we're actually watching The Sopranos which I know is a really old show but neither of us have seen it so we decided to watch that so that's what we're watching right now um, so I thought it'd be fun in my project life to start documenting what show we're been watching and then to kind of rate it at the end of watching it so I really wanted this one and I think that's a super cute stamp set um, I got this one and again this is kind of just for making my own project life cards um, I like the date and the subject um, what happened true story for the record makes me smile more than words um, I just think it's a really cute stamp set for just kind of general um, project life recording this one um, is just a number stamp set um, and again for project life I thought it would be perfect I have I use my roller stamp on my project life which you guys have seen if you've seen my project life videos um, but I just thought that this would be cute kind of change from that I don't really like my roller stamp <laughs> that I use so I thought this would be fun I like that it's got the date um, and all the numbers and I really liked that it's got the age here because um, I sometimes like to do like quotes that my son has said um, so I think it'd be cute to put his age you know for when he said the quotes so so yeah I just thought that was really cute stamp set they also had um the whole alphabet with the the same font um but I would like an alphabet stamp stamp but I don't know that I wanted this font for the alphabet stamp so I'm still kind of looking for a font that I liked for an alphabet stamp but for the numbers I thought it was I liked the size and everything so I got that and then the last stamp I got um, this one was on sale I believe um, so that's kind of what I got why I got it but I also I really liked this camera I just thought that it was really cute um, I got a couple um, stamped cameras from a pen pal like she had just stamped some cameras and then fussy cut them um, and she did it in different colors and I've actually used those on my project life so, so I thought it'd be fun to have a camera stamp so I could do kind of the same thing um, but I thought that was really cute um, and then I also liked these little hearts I thought were cute the little sun is really cute um, the little wonky star I think is adorable and then also these little dots down here for like lines um, and then this one says favorite and then it's got dots all around and then I really like this label here too um, I don't know that my writing will actually be able to fill that but I think that a stamp would like if I had one of these roller stamps um, this one is actually an Amy Tangerine one that has the has the dates like the Sunday Monday Tuesday 
so the days of the week on it. I think that would fit, yeah, that would fit perfectly in there. So um, that might be something cute to do on my project life where I stamp the day of the week in there. Um, and also I think that these stamps would probably fit in there and probably a lot of my citrus twist stamps would probably fit in there too. Um, so yeah, I just thought that was a really cute thing that I could add to uh, my project life. So that's everything that I got. Um, I hope you guys will check out Ellie's studio because I think that she has some adorable stuff. Um, and I hope you liked this haul and I will see you soon. Hopefully tomorrow I will have um, another update for you guys and do a little face-to-face -face update for you. So I will see you then. Bye.